All hands were on deck on Sunday, November the 1st, as several members of the Ithaca community gathered at the Greater Ithaca Activity Center Gym to celebrate the Mexican holiday, Dia de los Muertos. The event was hosted by Cultura Ithaca, an organization that strives to foster and share Latino and Latin American culture with the Ithaca community through easily accessible, free or low-cost, arts-based educational experiences on an annual basis. Multiple crafting stations were open to all present for creating some of the traditional Day of the Dead art. Folks had the opportunity to have their faces painted with Calaveras makeup, decorate Day of the Dead sugar skulls with glittery adornments and colorful jewels to represent departed souls and remember the dead in a joyful manner, as well as color in Day of the Dead paper skull masks with vibrant colors. <laughs> Those in attendance also had the opportunity to pay homage to past significant others through the Altar of the Dead. Folks wrote ofrendas, or offerings, which they tied up onto the altar to show respect for their deceased friends and family members. As the tradition goes, these offerings are left for the spirits to enjoy when they make their return back to earth in order to visit their living families and friends. El Dia de los Muertos is a day of remembrance for all loved ones that have passed. However, this year's celebration focuses on someone specifically. This year's celebration is dedicated to Selena, the iconic Mexican-American singer who unfortunately was murdered in 1995 at the age of 23. Director and founder of Coletura Ithaca, Carolina Osorio Gil, says she had chose to highlight Selena's life because of her life story. It's very tragic and romantic in that sense, and she has really rose to stardom in a way that not a lot of Latin American and Latino musicians have done. In honor of one of Selena's famous fashion trends called boutiers, women brought their own pairs of bras to the event to bedazzle. From ICTV, I'm Andrew Sullivan.